Hey everyone, it's Dr. Alan Bauman from Bauman Medical Hair Transplant and Hair Loss Treatment Center in Bauman Performance. And you know, as we age, we always see the signs of aging in our hair. Our hair can start to thin, our skin can wrinkle, but also our organs can fail. What if there was a way to protect our organs, to protect our hair, to improve our skin uh, with a new technology coming of age? You're gonna find out today why I decided to bank my hair follicle stem cells. So stay tuned, we'll talk about how I did it, why I did it, and why I think everybody should do it. So hair follicle stem cell banking is a really new technology that we're excited about here at Bauman Medical. And the reason why is because it's applicable for people who have thinning hair, but also for longevity and for health span as well in our department of Bauman Performance. And so why would we take our hair follicles and store them, cryopreserve them uh, for the future? Well, I can tell you that as we age, our hair can thin, our skin can wrinkle, we can lose function in our organs. Uh, we want some kind of regenerative medicine therapy to help with that. And there are many, many different uh, research projects that are going on right now. And in fact, many uh, people are getting stem cell therapy for repair of injuries such as uh, orthopedic conditions and, and such. And we now have cell therapy treatments for skin and for hair. And so by taking and banking our hair follicles, which contain stem cells, we can produce now a therapeutic intervention that specifically can target hair follicles made from your own cells. And hopefully sometime in the future, actually use those cells to repair organs, to replace them perhaps, and to keep our function uh, doing well as we continue to age on into the future. So how is this process done? The good news is that hair follicle stem cell banking is a non-invasive procedure. Essentially it just means plucking a number of hairs and then sending them off to the lab for cryopreservation. So when you pluck a hair, it contains some of that biologic material. And we check those hairs, make sure that they're uh, having all the biologic material that they need. And then they're sent off to the laboratory to be checked and to be cryopreserved. Then they can also be turned into, as I mentioned before, a hair treatment, which can be sent back to you. But more importantly for the future, you now have those cells frozen in time. So if God forbid you need them in the future, you'll have them. So one of the most important things about banking your stem cells is you wanna do it at the earliest possible time. Why is that? Well, as a younger person, your cells have the greatest potential for regeneration and repair. So each day that goes by without banking cells, your body's getting older and your ability to uh, rejuvenate is decreasing. So it's really important to get on top of this kind of technology at the earliest possible time. And that's why, basically yesterday, I banked my hair follicle stem cells. If this sounds interesting to you and you'd like to learn more about hair follicle stem cell banking and the benefits, please click on the links below and you'll get some more information from us.